Well, good day, farmers. Welcome back to Farm Sim Saturday. Um, okay, so today I wanted to actually do some some hay. <laughs> today I want to do some hay. I want to do it in this field here, though. So we're gonna buy that one. Yes. And uh, what is in that one right now? Uh, I don't think anything it's cultivated oh well that's perfect that's all i need all right so we're gonna plant some grass um i can't remember which ones do grass here so i'm sure to be caught probably this one will do it or not Doesn't look like these ones do that or cycle through here. So. Okay. That's the same. The same planter? No, maybe not. Okay. Oh, maybe it is. Grass, there it is. Alright, we gotta fill this up. So today we're going to do hay, like I was mentioning, and um, we got a couple of different things um, to try, as in brown balers and stuff. Let's load that up, and then we'll head her up there and start planting our grass. Uh, I've only got this one guy, I guess that should be should be sufficient. Yeah, we did a, remember we did a round baler video a long ago. It must have been an FS. Gosh, was it 15? It might have been 15. I don't remember now. And um, it went out pretty good. So try different balers out and stuff. It's like a demo day, right? So, <laughs> so we got a whole bunch of mods of the weeks for you, we'll say. We got to buy them all and stuff yet. Bring them over. Close those doors now. We don't need them open. All right. What's the best way to get to this field, actually? I don't really know. I guess we just go straight through and then... Uh, yeah. Oh, train's coming. Oh, are we going to make it in time? Oh, he's, whip he's whipping along pretty good there. Oh, but the guardrails are still up. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. So a hay and day. A hay and day. I'm going to do some hay. Now, I've got a, a hay bind I want to try too, but oh my gosh, it'll take forever to do it with this uh, the size of field. So uh, It's more meant for like a little wee field kind of thing. Um... So I wish I wish they'd change a thing in farm sim here. I was thinking about if you cut grass, it'll kind of dry on its own. You just have to go through a couple of day cycles, we'll say, like maybe three or four days, whatever, through the game here, and then it would be dry. But this, you have to run the tatter over it. You know, they want you to do those extra steps, I guess, which is fine. But grass will technically dry on its own, you know, if left long enough, we'll say. All right, so this is going to take a few minutes to plant. Hopefully we got enough seed in it. Holy cow, what on earth was that? That was kind of interesting. Just uh, all of a sudden he hooked up and went. Oh, well, they don't have any trees there. I never noticed this on this end. It just kind of drops off probably. <laughs> interesting. Okay, so we'll lower down, turn him on. We'll plant a little bit here, then I'll let, uh, let him take over because he's way better than I am. Yeah, but we let that go now. <laughs> All right, so. 
tree planting. Tree cut. That wasn't too bad. That was pretty fun. Um, okay, let me see. We'll drop this. I might get a guy over there helping if I got another planter. Let's see what we got left in the building here. There might be something. This little field actually right opposite us here would be really good size probably for that hay vine. This thing here actually might plant grass. Let's see. Grass, yeah, okay, good. Oh, I gotta go throw this again. Grass. Alright, now I don't I don't know if it needs to be fertilized, but I'm gonna fill everything up here, I guess. And we'll go over and uh, maybe use this guy for planting that little field there. Fertilizer and grass. I'm not sure if it would fertilize or not. Let's see here. Filler full of grass. All right. Because the big field, I think we're going to have to use the great big mower on it, you know. For, for cutting that. That's going to be just way too much for that little hay vine. So, um, yes. Okay, so we'll get this guy plant here. Let's see if he starts using fertilizer. I might have to fertilize another field if it does. Oh, yeah, it does too. Okay. Good to know. Growth and soil composition is zero on that one right now. So yeah, he's fertilizing there. So we're going to have to bring over some fertilizer for that field. Uh, okay, not a problem. Now, while we're... Let's just start tabbing through... Four trees. Oh, let's get this guy going. We need to go through and clear out some junk. Oh, that's a... That planter might do grass there, too. All right, let's take Big Bud. Big Bud. Let's see if his big planting machine will do grass. I really don't remember now. That would definitely help us. Should do. Well, let's see here. Oh, come on. So I mean, grass, grass. All right. This has got a fair amount of seed still in it. I'm not gonna struggle. I don't think. Well, maybe we'll top it up. Well, I don't know. It's probably got enough in it. Just trying to get this thing to fill here with this silly nozzle thing. It's a real nuisance. Cause I keep forgetting which one is which now. There's fertilizer. Okay, well, we might as well top her off, I guess. Get this guy over there, and that'll, that'll help plant him. Okay, and that one should be the seed. Holy cow. <laughs> oh, and here comes Mr. and Mrs. Impatient. Yep. Just give her, bud. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, I gotta figure out how to fold this thing back in now. All right, let's head her up. Get him some help planting up there. The signal. Get her done pretty quick, I think. Pretty much gotta take up the whole road. Oh, oh, oh whoa, this thing's wide. And then we'll have to get some fertilizer up there and probably uh, do the second stage fertilization on this one too. That'll get us a lot more hay, I'm, I'm hoping.
even if Big Bud's in the lane, it still takes up another half over here. She's meant for the field size, not the road size. Oh, yeah, I can't wait to get this guy stretched out again. I missed this big planter. This thing is awesome. I love it. Fantastic. Okay, let's open her up. Time to get down there. She'll be open, ready to go. Oh, yeah, he needs help here for sure. This is a lot of grass here. This is a fairly big, long field. It's not really wide. It's wide, but it's not really that wide as it is long. Oh, yeah, look at this thing. I love it. It's so awesome. Monster. Well, it's funny. Even the computer guys missed a bit of spot here. <laughs> AI that was running this field before. So we could even probably cut over here too if I really wanted to, but holy cow, we're gonna have some bales out here, I think. And I probably won't pick these up. I do have an auto load bale trailer. Maybe I'll try it a little bit, but I probably won't pick them up. But uh, to be perfectly honest, I don't know if we're actually gonna get into baling this week. This might be just the, the prep week here because um, a lot of work. Okay. We'll get all our stuff bought, though. Get this guy planting. All right, three guys planting. Sweet. Sweet. And he's fertilizing half of it, so we'll have to um, get some fertilizer for the other guy and... How do you stop? Oh, he's good. Okay, so let's jump over here. Um, how are we gonna do this? Um, well, let's let's have a look at him first. So, should be over here under bailing technology. Be nice if they put it in alphabetical order. Forestry equipment, bailing technology. Okay. Now, you know what? I bet you I didn't... Well, there's the hay bine. Yep, I didn't uh, initialize, initialize them, so... No, that's not. That's the wrapper. Okay, so... Oh, darn it. Uh, we'll have to jump out of game um, to initialize those. Okay. Forgot to do that, to, you know, when you first sort of start. And then before you come into game, it asks you what mods you want on and off on the little click chart thing. Okay, give me a sec. I'll be right on back. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> okay, load these up. Uh, bailing technology. Now we should have them all. Okay, so we got to look here. It says Anderson Group Mod. So that's... Um, that might be the bale trailer. Yeah, these are all the round bale trailers. Oh, well, we'll buy one of those. Ooh. Main color. John Deere green. Design color. John Deere yellow. Oh. Rim color would definitely be John Deere yellow again. There we go. Wheel set up. Ooh, bigger wheels. Ooh, yeah. Wow, they got uh, a few to choose from. I think you can go a bit lower with them. Yeah, those will do. Ooh, extensions. Like for what? Skid plate and fenders. Oh, I see. No, I don't want that. I'll do fenders, maybe. That'd be all right. Auto load. Yes. Oh, darn it. It just took everything off, didn't it? Ah, those are fine. Okay, let's buy one of those. And these are for the square bales. I don't know how they do. We're not doing those today, so. Square bale auto loader. I don't know what that is. <laughs> okay, so we've got a Ford baler. I don't know what that was. Something. <laughs> well. I don't know what that is, but anyways, wheels set up. Oh, no wheels. 
That's not good. I'm sure that'll be fine. Hope it's not too glitchy. Yes, okay, we'll buy that one. And a John Deere round baler, which, there it is. Whew. What the size of the buns on the back of that? Okay, there's no configuration on this, so. Let's just buy that. That's an easy one. And this press roll baler I found was kind of cool looking. Oh yeah, we want to see the mechanisms. So we'll buy that. And uh, this was another one too. Viacon, or Viacon, sorry. Oh, we'll buy that. I think I pretty much found all the round balers I could. And that's, I think, about it. Now, this is a big John Deere square. Square baler. So we're not going to do squares today. And that should be it. Okay, so now we got to go into mowers. There's a disc bind here. That's the new Holland, but I do have a... Okay, I didn't seem to load. Uh, hmm. Well... Nothing over here for, for bailing. It's all in there, so. Um, well, that's weird. There was a, a disc bind that I got. Oh, sometimes they get classified under other, other things. Miscellaneous uh, low loaders. Well, we might just have to use that other disc bind. There's not very many disc spines out there, and really, they're not going to be much different. That's a different icon there, though. Buzzsaw. <laughs> um, okay. Okay, so, bailing technology, let's just, no, uh, mowers. So we'll get this little disc bind. What's it say? He's 90 horse. Yeah, we'll put something behind him. In front of him. So let's buy that. Now, do we have... Yeah, big mower there. That's what I'm after. This one here. For the big field. We're going to need this one. Change color. Oh, the wheels? Really? Yeah, I'll we'll go with gray, why not? Rim colors, yeah. Okay, so we'll buy that. What else do we need? We need a tether. Uh, power harrows, no. Um, disc harrow, wind rollers, tethers. 13 meter. I wonder if I can find one that's bigger. Get that for now, and then we're going to have to, of course, windrow it again. Yeah, I got this one. It was kind of cool. It goes on the back of maybe the Ford tractor and 20 horse. Maybe we'll give it a shot. Put them on the Ford. Change color. Oh, nice. Can't seem to zoom into them any closer. Well, let's make it uh, sure. 3,000 for that, and then we'll need, um, actually, what is this one? 9.1 meters. That one's 14. Yeah, I'm going to go with the bigger one. Buy that. Okay, we should have a pile of equipment laying out here now. <laughs> sure looks like it anyways. And um, we're going to need some tractors, but I think I'm going to use... I think I'm going to use these ones we had attract, attached to the, to the tree machines here. Because they were pretty good track. I don't want to give them another run. So, we can probably load these on the trailer and take them up. i uh, still got a flat bed down here we can do that with. And a truck, which is good. Let's get the truck unhooked here.
Perfect. Should be able to squish them both on here, I think. It's going to be tight. Yep, she's got some overhang. <laughs> awesome. Perfect fit. Lots of room. Now I think uh, we can tighten the belts on, although it doesn't seem to do anything with those. So, uh, we're going to, they shouldn't go anywhere. Should be jammed in there pretty good. tractors might be too big for those balers. <laughs> Looking at them now, we'll hook them up and see, but we might be too big here for them. We might have to go a bit smaller. Might look a little unproportioned. You're probably already tied behind one of those big square balers, but these might be a little overkill. What's going on here? Glitching out on me. Look at our map, see how these guys are making out. Oh, why did this guy... So oh, I didn't get it restarted. Ah, my bad. My bad. Uh, get this guy going. Yeah, when I joined back into the game here, I totally forgot to hit on everybody started. Oh, a lady power. Sweet. And this guy. Where'd he end up? There. Yeah, maybe one of these tractors would be a bit better size for those balers. We'll see. We'll, we'll hook them up and try them here. Okay, we gotta put the ramps down. Oh, wrong machine. There we go. Should be good. I think these are going to be a bit too big. Well, that one John Deere baler there, that'll be perfect for that one. That little board baler, yeah, it's a bit too big. Okay, let's see here. Yeah, she's a bailing. She's a bailing. That's looking pretty good there. And I think I'm going to need smaller ones for these. So we're going to need three smaller tractors. Um, let's see here. Why don't we just buy some more? So we'll do maybe medium tractors. What do we got? Oh, there's a, some old Johnnies. How about some old Johnnies? That one's uh, 150 horse. Sure. I don't have matching tractors. You know what? I don't like this one. Sorry, I'm gonna take it back. Return! I <laughs> didn't even leave the parking lot. No, I just don't. I don't like the articulating ones like that. I didn't realize that was what that was. So. 
We're gonna return this one. Look, the tires are still shiny even. Okay, let's try. What was this other one? Is it articulating? Yeah, I think it's an articulator too, so. Bailing, I don't really want articulating stuff. Um, the 40 series is too big. What about small tractors? WD-45 might be all right on one of them. How about that? Does it have a three-point hitch? It does. That old girl there maybe might be all right on that. You know that, uh, what was it called? Bale compressor or, or straw compressor or whatever it was called? That would actually be perfect for that one. Uh, where'd he go? Oh, must be way over here. There he is. Ooh, it might be a little small. Could be good with the Ford, though. I'm thinking of this one, but... Might have to go something bigger for this guy. Oh, well. That might work. Wow, that is quite a mechanism there. Perfect, okay, now for the Ford. Small tractor, probably. I like the older stuff, the vintage stuff. These won't have three-point hitches, though, so they're not good for us. Uh, there we go, let's put one of them on. And... Oh, the steamer doesn't have three-point hitch. How about another Minneapolis? That'll work. Okay, what are we going to put on what, though? How about red to blue? There's no sound to this tractor. Good, good, good. I wonder why that has no sound. I don't remember that. Um, let's have a look here again. Six, 86 horse, 86, 105. Let's try another one of these. Much of that. Yeah, let's try. Where'd he go? Must be behind here. Well, that one's okay. Why does this one have no noise? That's weird. <laughs> well, we'll trade that one back in because sounds like it's electric. That's weird. Whoa, get back here. There's definitely a motor in it. I can see it. Well, let's get rid of this one then. Where's my cellar there? Okay. Oop, yep, save. That's probably a good idea. All right, now let's get... Make sure we got a machine for everything. This one would be good. Let's take him off. Got to get him off anyways. All right, that's perfect for that. I'll have to drive that whole thing over. But... Okay, what are we going to do here now? We've got... This spine, we got that one we'll put the Minneapolis maybe on the Ford Baylor. That's good. Let's see if we get him on the trailer here now.
Although we got enough room. Ooh. Small one, maybe. Um, small one. Small one. That one, maybe. And maybe this guy might. Ooh, I don't know. That's going to be right close. <laughs> Let's hook it up. See which one's smaller, shorter. Definitely the Dallas here. Yeah, this one's a bit shorter. What does this thing do? Lower pickup, turn on baler, hold baler. Okay. This is gonna be tricky because, oh geez. Can't turn too sharp on that one, I guess. See if we can get him up here. I don't. I don't think he's giving enough room for all these. He's got a long tongue on this thing. We need to sort of shorten up more. You get up here, anyways. Really? Well, isn't that odd? Oh, that one's not going to go on there. Well, then that solved that little problem. <laughs> that Alice was something else. This is probably going to be too big for me. <laughs> I don't think that's going to go too well. But it's loaded. It's kind of glitching me a little bit. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Actually, I might be able to get just down here. That might be better. Maybe quicker. Well, I can't really get through there, I don't think. But we'll see. We can sneak down through here. Well, that's quite a way to load a new baler, isn't it? Holy cow. Well, we'll just park everything maybe down here in this uh, dirt field here somewhere. Get in here somewhere maybe. Oh, there's more trees down here too. Oh, there's trees all over the place. Oh yeah, we got to go way down here. Helper E will be this guy, so that's done. That needs fertilized, probably. And boy, oh boy, we're actually getting close to being done here. Look at this. Only got a swipe in the middle left. gonna self-unload look at this there we go oh no <laughs> oh no there we go you can't beat the Minneapolis <laughs> that's hilarious So that one's ready. There we go. 
we were just glitched a little bit there. There we go. All right, let's figure out what's going on in the field here. soon have a collision, so we'll have to pull this guy off. And he'll finish her up. Up there, anyways. That didn't work out too bad. And we'll have to do the fertilizing, too, of course. Not... Well, yeah, it will both need both sides. But. All right, that's good for there. Let's get, um, get this guy back. We'll bring another load down. Uh, probably gonna have to do one at a time. See if we can get the, the big mower on there too. I don't know if that'll work or not, but Smoky. All right, let's see, what do we gotta load up next? We're gonna have to take down some fertilizer. Let's go get that maybe now. We, can always, we don't really need that other machines yet. We can bring it down after. We're gonna need someone to fertilize here again too. Maybe uh, see what we got down here. We'll throw two on. Should be able to actually get three on this for fertilizers. I would think they're not that big. Ramp coming down as we park. And we're good. Oh, okay. See, I know I got a couple of machines over there, but what do we got? Take this one. Probably that one. Ooh, it might not fit them all. This one only filled up, so we'll do that here. This is, eh, we're not going to get three on there, that's for sure. We might get two on there. All right, we'll load them up. Might get one of those self-drive ones too going here. And that's about it. <laughs> <laughs> One machine. <laughs> um, okay, well, that answered that question. I can't get that. more than one on, but okay. So over here, where are we, where are we, where are we, where are we? Over here? No, no, no. Um, I guess we don't have any fertilizer stuff over here. I thought we did, but I must have took it all back over. So they're all over here. Yeah, I think it was, whoops, stuck. I think it was actually this other guy I was wanting as well. We're not probably gonna get him on the trailer though. Those wheels will probably be too wide for the trailer. 
but I don't think it's going to fit. So, I don't think this is going to fit on the trailer. So maybe we'll just drive him over. I had more fertilizer machines than that. I guess I don't. I guess that's it. The fertilizer shed. Okay, so this field is fertilized once. So that's good for now. I think if we start growing it, it'll need a second shot. It's a 50-50, I guess, so. If I get two guys up here, it should be all right. I shouldn't need, uh, ooh, that was close. Shouldn't need to refill these guys, because I don't think there's really any fillers around here for liquid. Alright, so all the hay is planted. I wish we could actually plant hay, not just grass. That'd be kind of nice. Alright, so this one needs a bit of fertilizer right now on this side. Get this guy opening up here. is good. He's working on that. That's a, lot, a big sprayer on that thing. Um, okay, where were we now? Oh, here. I think actually that other one guy should be all right to do all that because it's almost, it only needs a half of it sprayed and then, then the whole thing sprayed again. Uh, maybe I'll get this guy, well, I guess I'll just leave this guy here for this field, maybe. Second row stage. All right, that's good. Now we can maybe load up else can we load up? Take up the grass mower, maybe? Load that on. Oh, what if I'm gonna ramp up? Ripping my ramps off on the road there. Four Ford, still working hard. here too, I guess. Whoa, she's going all over the place. Oh, and we got to figure out why we're going to do, I, I really like this combo with this on here, but I think we're going to have to do something else. So let's look at that right now. Put something else on it. Maybe um, none of those deers will have three point hitches, so that's no good. Uh, what about one of these goofy looking ones? Or what's this one? Yours is the old rotten nurses. Eh, that might work. Actually, what else can we change here? Engine setup. One more horsepower. Woo. Oh, yeah, we want a cab on it, right? Ooh, deluxe cab. I'll put the junkie cab on her. 
front loader attacher. No, I don't think we need that. Okay, that'll work better. I don't know why this one, it just won't load. Let's try it without the, the bailer on there. Does not like that. Put going off backwards. That's too bad. It's a neat little tractor. And no, it doesn't even want to go on backwards. Okay, well that's weird. I'm pushing forwards and it's going backwards. What is going on here? This is all messed up now. <laughs> okay, let's just sell that one right here. Let's find them here. There, get rid of that. Something was glitchy with him. All right, let's find the old Ursus. Takes you over a little while to get going. Good, she'll run that. Oh boy, that's really wide, isn't it? I'm gonna have to try to get this over as far as I can. I don't think you can swing that hitch now. Well, it's still not gonna be far enough. That's a pretty neat old tractor. I don't think I've ever tried that one before. I don't think there's anything else we could get on. No, we'll just have to take this guy down, I guess. Not loaded too well. It's a bit wide for this trailer, but hopefully it stays on there. Either, but <laughs> that was kind of cool actually. I'm really anxious actually to try this baler. I don't know, there's something about it. It's pretty cool. <laughs> See all the gears moving and stuff. Another baler down here. And we'll probably, uh, oh, we've got another baler to bring down yet, yeah, but I think I can maybe just drive it. We'll bring down the big mower, maybe if it'll fit on here. Get her all wound up again. Got to take back two. Uh, I wonder if I can fit him on here. Ooh, that's probably gonna be a pretty long load. I don't think that's gonna fit all on here. <laughs> let's give her a shot. Oh yeah, it's getting even longer now. Ooh. Ugh. Let's try her. Let's load her up. It's not even going to get on the trailer. <laughs> well, 
Got to at least get the ramp off a little bit there. Let's see what happens there. Oh yeah, it's not even going to stay on. Well, technically that should roll there, really. It's probably not gonna though. bigger trailer. Well, for now, that can just sit over here, I guess. I need it now, so. All right, a lot of trucking today to do. Getting everything down here. collision here. I didn't see that. Budrick's done here, so Mr. Sprayer needs to continue through here, and he's keeping up to me. Well, let's just drive this back. Whoa, let's just go around in circles. Easy, bud. And we shouldn't need this now either, so we can just take him right back. Poor bud, this little wimpy horn. Uh oh. Uh-oh. It's tight through there. Oh, a little Ford's still going. I bet you he needs repair, like, really bad, though. He doesn't use fuel, apparently, so that's, I guess, a good thing. in the yard here. There, he's kind of out of the way here. All right, so fertilizing's happening. That's good. Let's check on this. Oh, he's not too bad yet. He's doing good. That will just drive down after. I don't think we get that. Oh, we might get that more on that trailer. I'll just drive this guy down, I guess. some of these you can adjust the bail size uh doesn't look like this one i know we had that one i think with the john deere baler it was a cool one you can change the different sizes of your round bales worked pretty good
All right, we'll take the truck back. So we can get that mower onto it. So if you're wanting to try these balers yourself, just look up uh, on one of the uh, mod sites there, just look up round baler. I, I don't like putting on links because as this video ages, the links will probably become unusable and then, uh, you know, the way that works, right? So, uh, like look up Ford round baler, you'll find it. There'll be a, a link somewhere. You know, See, we can put the mower on here. I don't know. I wish this trailer was a little wider. It's not bad, but... Might fit on there, I don't know. All right, so there's our, our hay vine too. We'll give that a shot in this field over here, and then little raker we'll put on the Ford maybe and try that. This is gonna need a little bit more tractor though. It might fit on here. Oh yeah, or sort of got lots of room. <laughs> there we go. Let's see here now. Perfect. Oh, that's a big load, isn't it? Holy cow. We're going to need this mower, though, that's for sure. And we'll have to bring down the raker and stuff, but we won't need that for, oh, we won't need that for a wee bit. Lots of mowing to do. But we'll probably do the mowing next week, I think. I don't think we're going to get to all that this week. Mowing itself is going to take a little bit of work. As soon as a bit of a trailer hits there, you can maybe put a bale right behind it. I don't know if you can set a you know, the hired help to uh, to cut for you. I, I doubt it, but maybe we can. I don't know. Too bad, it moved a little bit though there, didn't it? Should I put this guy over here maybe? We still need to do some fertilizer. Whoa, I think you can actually drive off the edge there. Huh, that's kind of cool. <laughs> Leave him maybe in this corner over here. Let's see, could you actually drive off that edge? Oh, 
Oh, I think so. <laughs> I don't want to try it, but I think you could. That's neat. You can actually see it on the map. Huh. Okay. Um, what do we got else here? We're down over. That's actually off the map there. There he is. <laughs> okay, let's leave this planting machine here for now. I'll run this tractor back here. I think we're going to maybe need it back there. All right, back to the store. Probably use this one for that. Um, well, I don't know yet. The, the disc bind maybe, or we'll get something smaller for that disc bind maybe. Uh, we we'll use this for that uh, wind rower maybe. This one actually, this one might be still too big. I don't know. It's a pretty big tractor. Okay, what are we going to power that disc spine with? We need something probably smallish. Um, what else we got here? Uh, I think that might be a bit too small. Got this guy's 47 horse, 58. Uh, I don't know. Um, Tractors. Now, actually, you know what? One of these John Deere's might work on that because it needs a PTO. Oh, it is a three point hitch, too. Darn it. That'd be kind of cool. What about medium tractors? I like using the old vintage stuff, right? So, like the old 40 series, maybe. The old trike, we haven't used one of them for a while. Yeah, let's... Hmm. I don't know. I've got too many. <laughs> we'll put this guy on it, maybe. Skinny tires, narrow tires. Actually, those were kind of neat. Put some weight on them, maybe. Oh, you can change the stacks, that's right. Yeah, I'll go with that. Okay, where'd he go? There he is.
Okay, we gotta do unfold more. need to uh, fertilize it again so we'll probably do that next week uh, what else needs to go down that could probably go down it'll fit on here with all this just just we'll be able to put the ramp up all the way there we go all right we'll head down with this this will probably be our last load today and um, we've got the rest well we need the tether down there I guess we'll have to whip up later and grab it with something else maybe Do a search for another tether, maybe something a little wider. I don't know if there's anything any wider, but. That field by the shop there, we probably won't bail that one. We might, I don't know, we'll see. Um, I just want to test the smaller equipment there. See how that works with the rake and stuff. All right, I think we're all set. We just have to do some fertilizing next week and then get her grown first growth stage and then uh, she should be good to go. Right, good to go. We just need that tether down here, I guess. Get that uh, cut and tethered next week, and then probably windrow it. And uh, we'll see how we make out. We might, this might stretch into three videos just doing this because it's a fair big project, right? A lot of real estate here to rake and cut and tether and I wish like I say you could just let it dry over a couple of days and game days that'd be kind of neat. We don't really need this bale trailer, but we're not going to need it for a while. So let's, let's put the uh, header maybe on that. Too bad, it's not huge though. 
not like I'm looking for one that's like massive huge, but it's got to be one that's somewhat wider than that, I would think. Oh, I didn't put the ramp down. Oops. Just buy another tether from here. I don't know. I'll just drive it back to me here. Put it back on the trailer and drive it back up here so we can tether this field after. I never noticed that silo there before. Huh. There you go, eh? seems to work over there, but this one doesn't. It's like, it, oh, it's looking at the stack, I guess, it needs to be repositioned. It's weird. Oh, the ramp went down. That's weird. Maybe I touched it. All right, so she got a little upset there, but it's still on, mostly on. So maybe what I'll do is I'll get our grass ready to go for next week so we don't have to do all that. I won't put you through the sitting there watching me do all the fertilizing and stuff. All right. So let's see here. Just speed that up a bunch. And at this end is where our fertilizer guy was. Oh, we went down a little bit. Should have enough to, to do this though. Right way of our first growth stage, we should be good to fertilize. See if we can find. Let's pull this guy off the field. We don't need him there now. Let's put him way over this close. Oh, yeah, we got that machine too there. Forget. Well, I'm going to have to get all my tractors together that we bought for, for this and then do a big tractor show. That'd be kind of cool. Tractor and equipment show. just as wide as another one. It's a big machine. Oh, 
Okay. Our growth is not going to probably show us. Oh, actually, this field needs done now. Or does it? Oh, no, it doesn't. Sorry, I was looking at the wrong screen. Grass only might need one growth uh, fertilizer stage. I don't know. Let's just wait till it starts sprouting here and see what happens. Yeah, it's only 50% fertilized, so we'll have to probably do it again. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So that's probably both fields done. Let's whoop. No. Oh, turn that down. a little bit there but okay so that's good we'll get this guy spray in here too now and I think they're both are they both the same width yeah it looks pretty darn close doesn't it so that guy's going to have a fair bit of work to do. Hopefully he's got enough in him. 61. Yeah, it should be. All right. All right, we'll leave her there for today, I guess. Um, I'll get this, like I say, ready to cut next week. Get this fertilized, the second one here. And then let's see what it can say here. 100% fertilized there. And it should be 50 about over here somewhere. Yeah. 50. Okay. That's good. So we'll leave her there. We're there for this week, I guess. So thanks again for watching. We will catch you next week. We'll get um, the mowing and anyway, anyways done next week. I don't know if we'll get into the bailing or not because we got to do the oh the tedding and then the wind rowing and this is a fairly big field, so it's going to take a bit. That mower's fairly wide for this one, but it's still going to take a while. So I might not make you sit through that. We might just like do a fast time mowing kind of thing as we do that. So it's. I can't make you sit through watching the mowing this whole field, but we'll do a little bit and then we'll speed up the time or something. So, anyways, I'm very good. Thanks again for watching. We'll catch you all next week, and you guys have a good week.